Oh my god, I look terrifying. I had spray tan for the first time. Spray tan. And I need to wait a few more hours before washing it. And now it's kind of terrifying. But hi, this is a new renovation vlog. Excuse my face. Uh, I just wanted to show you around, tell you what we're doing. My parents are here, dad is helping me us. We're flaying the lemonade. Let me show you what has changed in these days and what we're working at, working on. So my room is going new flooring. This is the lemonade and this is the box I need to sort out. Holes where I need to film. But it looks so much nicer with the lemonade. I am now. I'm not trying to take everything off. Oh my god, even my arm is so orange. Everything off this wardrobe because we are gonna go in the little room that my dad is now doing the flooring. So we're just gonna take this apart. Maybe not take it apart, we'll see if we can just move them in the other room. And this is what we are working on now. Uh, this is like a tiny bedroom. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have time to remove this lovely wallpaper, but it's gonna be like this. It will be like a walk-in wardrobe. And the flooring is almost done and after that we will do girls room and then our bedroom yeah all of this stuff will go in the wardrobe when we put it there and that's why it's a freaking mess the aftermath uh, all of this stuff i took from the wardrobes and we tried to pull one so we can get the corner out first and behind there's a totally different wallpaper which I saw in another room. I think it was in my husband's office. And this is a pain to take off because it has this uh, kind of plastic top coating. And yeah. And here the same. It's no mold. It's the way this um, carpet. This is probably the old carpet they had in this room and it looks like a mold but it's not a bit fluffy actually and some wet wipes in there no treasure unfortunately i know it's very noisy but this wardrobe couldn't have been more perfect for here it's literally exactly the measurement this is the corner unit and the other two I'm gonna come through there soon and it's gonna be a nice wardrobe room. I just removed the old carpet from there and found some newspaper from 4th of April 85. And <laughs> let the ads L'Oreal uh, Perm 1095 high and low lights 1095 included cut, conditioner, blow dry, and set. Cool. This is for Redditch, which is uh, not too far from here. Man, what else did I see? Uh, the one with the um, properties. Beautiful detached homes for £32,000 with a garage as well. Not bad. I'm not really sure how much it will be in today's money though. Then we also have some glucose hallucinations. No idea what is that. Gift to suit every lady pharmacy. What else? Lots of more properties in here. Cool. Easter holidays. <laughs> this is the wardrobe in. I already started to put stuff inside and looks so good. They fit perfectly in. We can't put the door in here because there's no way to move this one a little bit more forward. It was gonna be without a door. Good. And now we just have to put the shelves in here and we're done. It's the day after and my dad started working on the girls' bedroom, flooring. So we're just going to do half 
move the stuff over <laughs> do we ever have because there's way too much stuff in here to move and i just use that for the girls because we put the wardrobes in the water room i know we had this from before so let's update for now this is just the underlay and he's downstairs cutting oh we also realized that the plug that we had is just there the double plug i thought it was like a normal plug no it was just a multi-plug plugged in there which is i mean this house just keeps on giving so we can't use that plug anymore it's basically i don't know yeah you can see it's there and we're just gonna have to take it off because it's technically just a multi-plug and we're gonna have that and we also added a double plug in here but it used to be out there before today is our bedroom's turn my dad is there working they've been working for hours now trying to uh, change because a lot of things There's another hole in there and the electrician put another plug hence why this um, we just put the wardrobes in here the whole house is a mess really wardrobes are here these are gonna be redone for the girls but for now see there i did already design a packs for our bedroom that will go in here hi men at work and i'll show you how the girls room like looks like it's still full of stuff from our bedroom but the flooring is so beautiful this room looks so much bigger because there is no big wardrobe here uh it's a mess because as soon as we order our packs uh, the girls are gonna get the our wardrobe so i can sort out this it's just our mattress that we brought here but the room is so much bigger and i just put this one down because one day in the evening when we change we usually sit on the floor and it's quite um maybe unhygienic on here so i just put this i need to wash this anyway and this is the reality of having to move all the stuff from one room to another one you can see the floor here is done and the wardrobes are in those are storage from ikea i need to buy a few more because they go in there perfectly uh, and we're gonna get uh, another billy bookcase on the wall that's everything for now and i'm gonna update you when our room is done the flooring because of the walls and everything else i'm gonna have to work on later we update on the flooring we are in the playroom at the moment and it's almost done i didn't feel much in here um my dad and my husband yesterday removed some of the wooden planks from underneath and they had to be changed and now it's just this little bit what is left to finish today and we also got our packs delivered um it's a lot so my job now is to go in the bedroom and try to i don't know move a bed or do something because this will take a lot of space to it needs a lot of space to be built so we'll see i didn't realize it was so tall which is cool you see this is our bedroom again the flooring is so pretty and um, basically the wardrobes are gonna be tall all the way up but because we have like a kind of a slope in there the wardrobes are gonna stop here and this is just the cheapest option because if we were to get custom made it would have costed us so much more by this way even if i have like a little space in here it's fine there will be space for the washing basket and maybe um i don't know it's just gonna be like that basically like now but we saved some money and nobody really comes in our bedroom rather than us so now i need to move all of this so we can put the bed all the way up and then we can move these i don't know where and build the wardrobes moved everything over here bed is up here is all ready 
and I need to move the boxes upstairs. This little piece, uh, I decided to put it here, you know, like wardrobe room, instead of throwing it away from now. So now I need to get all the boxes up here. We're gonna start already a few bits about here. Put it here. This is, is this from the second pack? I must say that doing this with long nails uh, it's not easy just have to put it there mm. go in there you go something already looks like a wardrobe and this sloping thing in here is worrying me <laughs> we need to yeah you just have to put those three leave it leave it don't do anything just do those yeah, and then we're gonna turn it oh i love the flooring here also on the camera it looks so much more expensive rather than what it is hmm? and the model support it's pretty straightforward this it's just big pieces if you get the taller one <laughs> the failure of today uh we try to flip it up and there's not enough ceiling space and I tell you, it's home now. The, the, the what are you doing? I'm just demonstrating. <laughs> but no, wait, 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 wait. No, there's no way this can. Basically, it fits just right, but no one is built. So we're going to have to dismantle it and build it in a different way that is already oh, upright. <laughs> no, it doesn't fit. So fail. We're just going to have to take it off. In the attempt to undo it, mm -hmm. we basically mm, try to undo an IKEA uh, furniture. It's impossible. So we basically broke the backing. We just somehow gonna put it back. Uh, move away, please. And now. Devin is trying to remove the nails from the, the back. <laughs> oh. yeah. Imagine if we would have paid for someone to put it together. Maybe, yeah. I know you are there. This is gonna take us a while, but we need to. We need to. Sleep tonight in here, sir. So. The two parts of the video. <laughs> Here is where we are currently at. You can see it's like a few centimeters away from the ceiling. This one is just moved a little bit forward because we messed up. You see with this line here on both. So this is changed. We're gonna change that tomorrow. Doors are still there, so we're gonna put it tomorrow because. We're tired, we just had dinner. This is where we are at. Uh, I put, we put the shelves in there, I wanted, uh, it was impossible, I think, maybe I didn't count it right, to have it all of the same distance. And I chose to have like a taller, a bigger distance on the bottom there, so I can put a basket. And maybe for the others, I'll wear baskets as well, I will see. Um, thinking about it, I am thinking of buying another bar of these. And this side is going to be mine, so I'll put the bar all the way up. And then put another one so I can have um, two. So it's kind of double up space my husband doesn't really need much he doesn't have many clothes we also have this one from ikea as well uh, as the side tables and um it holds a lot of our stuff here i'm currently 
changing the bed sheets because everything has been like had some marks and it was dirty so it's all gonna be nice and fresh today and tomorrow is just the doors left that we have to put you can also connect them with these things but i'm not going to do it now because whenever i get to paint in this room i want to be able to pull them out paint and then push it back and after that we can connect it and um, that's my dad there cleaning up stuff and putting all the tools away and yes yeah, switching off for the day it's just gonna go and relax so i'm really happy with it and this is just the little space that is left but i'm thinking in here i'm gonna have a long curtain road with nice curtains put it all the way up there and you're probably not gonna even be able to see the hole in there here is the wardrobe with the doors um they were fairly easy to put on but we don't have handles the handles i wanted were like very long and brass color they are sold out in all ikea around me so i'm gonna show you what i'm gonna do but first ready put the clothes inside like i said i need to move this all the way up buy another one because down it's a mess and i know you can buy drawers and all the stuff but they're kind of expensive and we already have those so we don't need any more drawers this one here is with shelves and i can hear tear it still hurts mommy what hurts she beat her lips hmm don't bite it, leave it. Oh, and this side is just my husband. I'm basically using my foot. This way. And again, I just threw some stuff down. But, oh, and. No, I'm not painting today. In there, I already put my winter clothes away, which is a very handy um, shelf up there because this two bags are from ikea as well and you can fit two full in there you can see this one is full this one is kind of empty bam great and it's so big you can see there's just a little gap in there. <laughs> oh. these are the handles that i got these are from b <laughs> B&Q and they are 510 millimeters um, long so you can see the size and um, because they are silver I'm gonna spray paint it brass and I just like how long they are I'm sure they're gonna look so good so I'm gonna have to take it out of this packaging and go outside and spray paint it For a change, I'm gonna finish a renovation vlog with makeup on uh, because I usually look homeless in these vlogs. So I'm gonna wrap around everything that we have done and yeah, that's gonna be the end of this vlog. And then I will start with taking room by room. The girls, they don't, they're not fighting or crying. They're just dancing on princess, Disney princesses song playlist songs playlist on spotify i'm gonna turn you around show you what we achieved thanks to my dad my husband also helped him they are already home now and i miss them a lot and i thank them for all their help so let's just wrap this up and yeah the house is looking so good okay i will start with the landing upstairs and i just i just love it i just love it finally we have hard flooring instead of the horrible just wood that was underneath in all different colors and we can actually walk bare feet and i can wash the floors i need to do another coat of paint in here we all know that i painted it before christmas and then we had more electrics work done hence why that's there and I've got some other spots that I need to paint then we also the same flooring carries on in there but just the little kind of 
airing cupboard that we have um, as you can see I need to paint this girls bedroom is all nice and the floor is here finally I don't have the horrible black carpet that was here and it was like impossible to clean and I moved the wardrobes in here this room uh, is going it's going to take a while to um, redecorate it's a lot of things to do here so moving on let me just show you our bedroom the flooring again is so nice and clean um, they started to put the laminate and I didn't see which direction they started to do it I would have wanted it to be that direction maybe because is the way you go into the room but we put it in that direction it doesn't really matter it's all done it's nice and clean uh, but this probably is going to be the first room to get makeover next because the only thing I need to do is to remove the wallpaper there paint the walls and you can see here I took two samples of the Dulux um, colors and none of them match this color because I wanted to find something similar to this which is just nice beautiful calm color but uh, I don't know then but stay up cry, uh, not cry, singing so in case you're wondering and then our wardrobes I'm just so happy with wardrobes they look so nice and clean, makes the room just so much taller because they go up there. You can see that we probably they're not like, they don't look even, but it's because we did not connect the wardrobes together. I'm gonna do that after I paint everything in the back and the ceiling. Then we have my husband's office again. It's all nice and neatly done the flooring um this room is complete he already ordered some blinds for the windows because online no online in the stores i couldn't find anything with a dimension of the two windows that he has here so this one it's all done same as my office which is a mess at the moment i need to clean in here because i filmed today that's why it's all around the flooring in the playroom as well it's done i'm not showing you the rest of the room because it's a mess i didn't clean in here yet we also i went to ikea and i got the desk this is uh, the desk which is similar to my husband's upstairs from ikea I paid 39 pounds for this very cheap and um, also got two of these one of the one is in the kitchen um, but i've got two of these so the girls have a nice kind of um, crafting place and i like to edit videos in here just because i can see everything out and emilia is doing her homework here and that's pretty much what we have achieved this time and it was a lot i think every time i hold the camera every time she has to do that and she's going She's got a voice that literally penetrates your tympanus. It just hurts my ears. I love you. Mommy. I love you too. Mm -hmm. Ooh, let me get down. <laughs> Please, mom. Your two little princesses in here. Oh.